Hello and welcome, it's The Grape Explorer. Now I'm particularly excited today because I haven't done a gadget review in some time. And when I've done gadget reviews in the past, they have either been incredibly successful, like my vacuum pump, which I do really use all the time, or they've been completely ridiculous, like my wine spraying decanter dispenser thing, which I never took out of the box again after I did the review. Now the reason that I haven't done that many gadget reviews, and I've not really been able to, is of course there aren't really that many wine gadgets available on the market. They're associated mostly with the service of wine. They would be things like decanters, openers, corkscrews, waiters friends, those types of things. And then of course you've got the storage of wine as well, which is where the wine pump comes in. Today I'm going to be looking at a gadget that opens a bottle of wine. And it's one that had been popping up a little bit in my Amazon feed, and so I decided to go out and buy one. Amazon I think it was about 10 pounds so it arrived today and I'm going to do an unboxing and we're going to test it out during this video now what makes this particular product different is that it doesn't use a corkscrew at all it uses a needle inserted through the cork the idea being that pressurized air is then applied which will force the cork out of the bottle um, I'm not really sure if that's something that's going to work or not but let's give it a try so this is the air pressure bottle opener now what I did was I went out and bought the deluxe kit because I'm particularly fancy about these things. And so this kit actually comes with a number of different things. Uh, it comes with instructions, good. It comes with a pourer, which is gonna come in very handy. It comes with a bottle stop, which I really like. It comes with a foil cutter, which I think is really great as well. And then it comes with the actual item itself. So let me get these things out of the way so we can take a proper look. And I must be careful with the needle on the end. So as you can see, there is quite a large needle on the end of that. Hopefully that's coming through to you. It's a bit like a giant EpiPen actually um, for uh, allergy sufferers. Um, and has the potential to take your eye out if you're not too careful. But let's take a look at all the other gadgets as well. You know, now that I've got everything lined up on the table in front of me, there's a couple of things that I've noticed here from this kit. So I've got my bottle, uh, I've got my cork remover here. I've got a very nice foil cutter here. I've got my bottle uh, topper, but I've actually noticed that it has a pump built in. So I think that's pretty good. And I've just noticed that my bottle pourer is something akin to a bit of an aerator as well. Uh, so may possibly open up that wine a little bit more. No guarantees on that, of course. Uh, I've got a corked bottle of wine here, ready to go. So let's start by using my foil cutter first, get this nice and open. Let's see if this does a professional job to begin with. How about that? Straight off the top, lovely. Okay, now this is the bit I'm just gonna need to refer to the instructions with to see how it works. Uh, I think you just stab it in, pump it. It's holding the pump like this, so it wants me to pump like that. I'm not sure I'm gonna do that. Certainly not on camera anyway. It's telling me to insert the needle through the cork. Here we go. Through it goes. Hopefully you can see me putting that through there. Okay, that's now down at the bottom. So you might have noticed here, this handle lifts up and then I force that down. Now I'm presuming by doing this repeatedly, oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> was not expecting that. I thought it was something that would come out gradually. Uh, how about that? Uh, absolutely fantastic that is. Uh, I can't believe that works. Look how badly I've put that cork needle into the cork. Um, I can't believe that works so quickly. That's absolutely incredible. Um, I wasn't expecting that at all. Do you know what? For, for someone who might not be au fait with a corkscrew, this is going to be an absolutely ideal gift. Um, I can't believe it worked that quickly. It was, what, two, three pumps maximum, um, and it, it popped the cork straight out of the bottle. You can tell my surprise here and my enthusiasm for this. It's because I'm so surprised. I didn't think it'd be that straightforward at all. Oh, I deserve a glass of wine after all that. It'd be great to see what that looked like in slow motion when it happened. Oh, and a lovely Malbec as well to enjoy now. Okay, wow, I can't believe that. So, of course, the other things that come in this kit are the pourer, uh, which, which go in there nice and easy. Just to show it off. 
There we go. I wouldn't say that that's aerating the wine in any way. That just looks like a pretty standard pour to me. And then finally, we've got the bottle stop as well. And like I say, that's got the ability to allow you to pump a bit of air in, seal it as a vacuum, and actually that's gonna make your wine last that little bit longer. So, wow, what a fantastic piece of kit for 10 pounds, the air pressure bottle opener. Uh, link to that is gonna be below uh, for anyone who's looking to check that out. That might make a pretty good gift for Christmas, actually. Um, I can't believe, I still can't believe it worked that well. Um, I would bet that this works better on younger wines with perhaps younger corks in them. Um, you know, the older a wine gets, the more the cork starts to disintegrate. I possibly wouldn't recommend this to be used on an older bottle of wine. But certainly this one's from 2017. Uh, more than happy to have used that. And I end up with a pretty intact cork. I've just got to work out how to get it off. Uh, so for now, there we go. Uh, wine opening. Easy. That was too easy. Um, let me know in the comments section below, is this something you've used before? Uh, and if so, have you recommended it to others? Is it something that other people see? Or any other novel ways that you know to remove a cork from a bottle? I'll be in touch with you again soon. I'm the Grape Explorer. Cheers.